Hey everybody, it's Rob Nazarian with Talk Android, and uh, today we're looking at the Samsung Galaxy Tab 7.7 .7 LTE on Verizon. It actually launches today. Um, it, this this tab was actually originally announced September 1st of last year, uh, 2011, at the IFA conference in Berlin, and it's finally made its way to the states. It is the world's thinnest LTE tablet um, at 7.9 millimeters thick. It'd be nice if they could have made it 7.7 .7 millimeters, but that didn't work out. Weighs 340 grams, and um, the biggest competition right now on Verizon of LTE uh, for an LTE tablet would be the Droid Zyboard 8.2. And that's thicker, 8.9 millimeters, and weighs also more at 386. Of course, it does have a little bit bigger screen at 8.2. Oh, before I get, well, as usual, there really isn't much in the box here. Um, basically, your charger. Now, it's a proprietary charger for this device, um, which is a little bit of a negative. Um, but this tablet does look nice um, this feels nice too uh, I, I know the 8.9 I remember was pretty slick and so was the 10.1 this actually is pretty nice and smooth I like this finish uh, very nice there's the uh, thickness we have the volume on the side and the power button there and um, here is the uh, SD card slot. You can go up to 32 gigs there. It comes 16 on board. And your inside here would be your LTE SIM. You have a 3.2 megapixel camera in the back, which is a little low, but it's a tablet. Who cares? They gave you a really a decent one in the front at 2 megapixels. Let's fire it up. Uh, as I said, it's a 7.7 .7 inch screen. It's the resolution is 12, um, 1280 by 800 Super AMOLED Plus. Uh, and I believe it's the first uh, Super AMOLED Plus tablet ever. Um, and it's 1.4 gigahertz dual core. So um, it's also enterprise safe. And the retail, a little high. $499 for it with a two-year contract. TouchWiz is on board, and the other negative is Android uh, 3.2. Uh, let's verify that. Well, you can tell anyways. Now, part of the TouchWiz stuff here is when you go into the um, notifications, you can quickly uh, go into some settings here, which is nice. Um, so you can change the display easily, uh, do whatever you want with it. Um, and you can go right into the settings quick. And we'll go into About Device, and it is Android 3.2. So, another nice feature that comes with TouchWiz is the ability to take a screenshot, basically right there. And there it is. Uh, you're going to have your normal widgets for Samsung, your picture frame, your clock, your weather, uh, your social hub, the agenda. It's five home screens. You can zip through them quickly here. Um, there's also this quick uh, launcher here where you can quickly go into uh, some some apps right there. That's also nice and you can edit it as well. A uh, couple other things that they added for widgets is uh, I believe which we've seen in the 8.9 um, or maybe it was a 7.0 plus maybe the 7.0 plus the pen memo um, which lets you of course this isn't a galaxy note stylus doesn't come but you can write with your finger or write with a with a stylus uh, if you get one and you can create some notes and so there's a widget there and uh, that shows up nice um, and I believe there's also another memo one Uh, basically a straight memo right there so you can see you can see you get swipe uh, as the keyboard and you can give yourself little memos 
I'm not a swipe fan, but I know a lot of you guys are. And save it. And there's a memo to yourself, so that works well too. Whoops. And you can, re as you can see there, you could resize it as well. So all in all, um, I like in the feel of this. I really like the smaller tablets, the seven inch range, seven point seven, eight point two. I really do like them. Um, I think they feel easy, you know, good in the hands. And like I said, this this one here might be Samsung's best uh, tablet to date as far as the overall feel and quality. I like this a lot. The screen is uh, is gorgeous at uh, twelve eighty by. 800 Super AMOLED Plus, that's gorgeous. Um, so I'm looking forward to spending some time with it. I will do a more in-depth full review, uh, maybe in about a week or so, after I spend some time with it. Um, so look for that as well. Uh, so, But uh, thanks for watching, and um, again, this is Rob Nazarian with Talk Android.